Hi there. My name is Stella Bright. Um, today I just thought that let's speak about uh, the song Africa Bumani, which is my first single in 2023. So um, I'd just like to take this moment and say that let's come together, just listen to the story of how Africa Bumani, the singer of Stella Bright, came about today so that you can get the glimpse of at least how it derived to become the song, fully song that has been recorded and published out there. For you to get it, uh, you can also go to all the you know, streaming platforms. You can get it there. Just to get the glimpse of what is happening within the song and why it came about and to become Africa's money. So this is very important because it's a very powerful song indeed, but I love it so much. And it becomes very, very uh, odd for me to come up with that message just to try and share to the world and to particularly the, the people in Africa. That's why I'm an African in South Africa. But of course, making sure that at least to, to get to share about some of the frustrations that we come about or come across almost every day. So that is why I've just said Africa Bumani. Okay, let's start here. Africa Bumani came after the realization of uh, some of the you know, trials and tribulations that we have just passed through and those that we are suffering from, those that we are coming across almost on a very, on a very day. So on a daily basis, we know what we go through. So Africa Bumani, it is relating to all those issues that we understand, issues that we are faced with almost on a daily basis. So issues that you can be um, uh, coming from um, uh, uh, um, um, poverty, issues of um, um, suffering, issues of um, bullying, issues of killing one another, issues also of um, illnesses or sufferings based on the ailments that we are coming across in Africa. Also, the issues of, as already said, the killing of one another, you know, those other problems in which we are faced with, it's not like they cannot be, you know, uh, handled or being, 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 being attended to or uh, being um, solved in a, in a way. So, Africa for Man, it just came to say that um, let, let's all, as the African continent, realize that we are having a problem. The problem in which we say it is based on those elements which are affecting us as a people. Well, as we speak about Africa, Sia Tupeda. Sia Tupeda means it is a Zulu, Zulu language to say we are suffering. Suffering in many ways. Suffering from illnesses. Suffering from lack of jobs. Lack of income. We are suffering. We are staying without shelters. We are suffering. We don't have food. We are hungry. Africa. Africa. Please hear us. Hear us that we are suffering. We are starving. Siapuda, meaning we are sick, Africa, we are sick, please Africa, understand, at least that we are suffering, we are sick, and of course this is becoming tiring. We are sick and tired, but we are sick. Let's work together. Understand, Africa, the problem that we are facing. Don't ignore those moments that 
we are suffering we are we are trying everything but it seems that the solution comes very gradually like the guidance name things so it's all about that but on this song it, it catches those elements and that is why it is not infuse much more of the lyrics that are going to be bombarded on the song so that you can no it's just a repetition mostly of this very pertinent point that we need to touch on africa siaku pega we are suffering africa siaku we are sick malnutrition is keeping us cholera ebola you name them africa what i say i can we come together let's realize that really this is a you know it, it's a pandemic on its own it, it needs a very thorough assistance to look into it can we get a partner here to uh, assist that africa humanity and then there are those other another element where it the challenge to speak about the death that we are encountering almost every day. Our brothers and sisters are killing one another. There are some raids reported here and there. Almost every day, large number of raids, large number of kidnappings. Africa, can we wake up and say, enough is enough. Because these are the problems that we encounter almost every day. We hear the steps reported about such problems. Sibula Lama saw to us. We're killing one another. We as Africans, we are killing each other. Can we, can we just wake up and realize that these are the problems that most of them we create in our own can we limit them can we we stop it and just realize that we are human beings we all deserve to live in peace in happiness and harmony in africa because we are african why where did we get the thing of self-hate That is why Africa for money, it doesn't point the finger, it doesn't point any organization. It just say, if you're an African, you live and breathe in Africa. You breathe the air in Africa. You drink the water in Africa. You got the spirit connected in Africa. What are you saying about it? Are you not affected? Are you not feeling the pinch of all this? shenanigans that happens to our lives almost every day that we read and see our brothers and sisters, uncles, mothers, sisters, brothers, whoever, children, adults, you know, you name them all, all the people who breathe and live in this continent that we suffer so much. Can we change this suffering? Do we know, are we aware of just ignoring, saying, let Bible be let anyone be for himself that we are saying then if that's the concept where are we leading ourselves to this song is leading to know there are some instigators that carries on in africa through the barrel of a gun. Report and report after report. It's about that. Africa, the man. All of us, as a collective, let's agree. Are we agreeing that we have got a challenge? Which is all those that are listed. It's about this beautiful song that tries to remind us, asking this beautiful question without negatively pointing a finger at anyone but just to say are we aware of what is happening in africa do we see this what are we saying about them what can we do 
how to do it in order to resolve to come up to the resolution of all those problems that are listed and all those other ones that are not even listed here but you know what are those africa are we aware of them can we come up with a solution any panacea that we can get in order to resolve all of this and start living in peace and harmony freedom to all Africans. Can we reach that? Sia Supeza Humani Sia Kula Humani Humani, humani, si la